What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, the Hijabi Hermione. Uh, here we are uh, in a level called the Cistern, which sounds pretty gross, honestly. Um, we managed to get through Palace Midas last time. Um, the sound effects are a little creepy, like there's some animals or something down here. Oh, hello, there's already a rat. Um, but hopefully it's not too far from here until we find the Skion. So, I mean... We're in some kind of sewerage system. I, I, it's gross. I don't want to say it, but okay. Can I push this through? Is pushing it a good idea or should I have pulled it? <laughs> Who knows? Uh, we shall find out. No, pushing it seems to have been a good idea because it looks like there's a switch up there. Okay, if I, if I remember correctly, just based on, because I feel like... I feel like there's no other level with this design. It might be, I don't know. Um, this is like a series of rooms, like one after another, where you sort of like, there's a challenge or something you have to solve. So it's not like a clever labyrinth, like the last level. It's kind of just like a series of obstacles or something. Yeah, so that opened up. Lots of rats. Good thing Nara's not scared. Oh, I hear lions. Pretty sure that's background noise. So I don't actually have to worry about actual lions, but that's pretty cool. Nice and atmospheric. Okay, what's down here? More rats by any chance? No. Hello? Oh gosh, and we are lagging like crazy. Limitations of DOSBox. Okay. This a hundred percent. Okay, this is not the level I was thinking of. This is maybe there's another level that looks like this. This is also kind of a labyrinth, if I remember correctly. Okay, there's rats down there. I wonder if I should deal with them first. Can I climb back up? Surely I can climb back up somewhere. Uh yeah, there's no way that like I can't get back up. There has to be a way up. I only took a little bit of my health. This music is awesome. Is he gone? Oh, he's in the walls. Spooky. Did he get... Is there like an opening? Yes, there's an opening. Okay. You know what? Usually I explore the top level first, but I'm feeling adventurous. Maybe we should explore this... Um, ground level first. You know what? Yeah, let's let's like work our way up from the bottom up. So, um, let's see what's in here. Oh, the alligator's back. Crocodile, sorry. I'm so used to calling them alligators because of video games, even though I come from a place that has crocodiles, not alligators. Just habit, I guess. Okay, we got one of them. Let's get the other one. Come on out. Now, maybe in Tomb Raider 2, because I know that in Tomb Raider 2 you get a harpoon gun. Maybe I'll be brave enough to fight these guys underwater, but I can't do that in this game, so I'm not even going to try. Okay, we got two openings, the one they came from, and then there's one over this side. So let's see what's here. Oh, it's a secret. Hello. Magnum clips. I would not want to have encountered the crocodiles in here. Okay, that was a secret. Good eye then, that I caught that. Is there anything else suspicious? I don't think so. Uh, around this side there's just that, which is the, the ramp um, up to whatever is up that side. There's a lot of um, like algae down here, which is pretty cool. Like, how's that for detail? Okay, what's in here? I hear something. But can I even get up there? That's the question. Can't climb up there. It's rats. That's what it is. Can't even shoot them from here. Okay, let's see what's down here. Oh, and I can't even climb out. 
Okay, so that's why it's not useful to explore the ground level first. I was being adventurous and... Yeah. Uh, basically a bunch of dead ends for now. Okay, so... Let us climb out here by the ramp. See where this leads us. Lead us upstairs, hopefully. Oh, we can't run up there. Okay, can we climb up? Lions need to chill. They can't go up there either. Um, okay, but we can go up here. And up here, which probably means we can climb up to this room above us. But I don't see a way to get across to that staircase, which needs a key anyway. I mean, why does that even exist on the, the far right side of the room? Because, I mean, there's nothing there. But, let's see. Uh, wait, hang on. Okay. So I might need to backtrack to fetch that. But let's see what's through this door. We didn't encounter Pierre at all last level. Um. Oh, speak of the devil. Bonjour. Almost ever. Oh, should I be in? Now disappear, come on, like what are you doing? Surely I've shot you enough times now. Come on, I must have shot you enough times. Yes. Okay. I decided to trigger that disappearance. Okay, so there's water down there. Now, I wonder what happens if you fall into it. Can you actually get out? Interesting questions. What does that do? Oh, does something with the water? Oh, I think it floods the cistern outside, right? Which may open up some areas for us. Um, you know what? I am going to just switch that off very quickly and just because it's bothering me, I'm going to go back and explore that area and then I'm going to come back here. I know it's nitpicky, but like, I'm just, I'm bothered by the fact that I haven't explored everywhere I've been. Okay. Oh, that was close. Uh, could have done better than that. Thankfully, in the later games, it doesn't lag like this when you enter a large room. At least not that I'm aware of. Okay, so I could go over the top. Well, you know what? I'm going to come back this way. So let me go over the top. Save some time and then I'll I'll go by the crevice on the way back. Oh, hello. That was a good call. There's a key here. And it's a rusty key. Okay. Rats are not much of a nuisance. I just... Well... They're a nuisance, they're not, like, a problem. So that's why I shot him from above, because it wasn't actually <laughs> exciting to fight him normally. Okay, let's get back across. And I see two doors, which could probably both use a rusty key, right? Let's see what's behind the second one. Twice, because I might have just used the key. Uh-oh. Nah, but surely there'll be a second key. Okay, well, that doesn't help me at all. Okay, well, there is going to be a second key. There has to be. 
Oh, that was very close. <laughs> uh, what's up the side? Nothing. Okay, I'm starting to feel better that I've explored this side. But now there is nothing I can do there. So there's no point. So let's head back. Um, switch on the water. Don't know what that'll do for me. Maybe I can reach somewhere that I couldn't get to before. Um, and then, I don't know if we should dive down into the water in that room because it doesn't look like you can climb out. So maybe I should explore the room first and then get into the water and see what's down there. Let's grab these shotgun shells quickly. got some really strong arms hey like <laughs> you know because I used to play this when I was really young um there was a gym that I used to go to with my dad as a kid and there was a swimming pool uh a little tiny one for the kids and it had like this wall just like this next to it and because of Tomb Raider <laughs> I literally tried to like shuffle or or whatever the word is what she was doing along the wall and I just couldn't do it like and I imagine that most people can't do it. So I don't know how she does it. She's got some super strong arms, like some major biceps or something. And some major invisible biceps too. Um, yeah, <laughs> superpowers. Okay, so let's not jump down yet because I don't see a way out. For now, can we explore what's up here? very confusing. Hello. What's back here? Anything? No. Just a tempting place to explore, but nothing useful. Okay. Can probably jump across. Hello, I can jump up there. Ooh. Could I jump across there? Okay, maybe I can climb up. There's no way I can reach up there from now, but I could probably do this. Yes. And there's also something up here. So what's across on the far side? Did I just do things in the wrong order? I think I just did things in the wrong order. Oh man, that was such a bad idea. Watch out for that. I keep making this mistake. Um, yeah, generally just be careful when you drop down places. Bad idea for me. Okay, should be able to make it across. Let's just, um, top up our health. And grab all of this. And then we'll go explore that opening that I saw back there. But didn't explore because I wanted to come grab this stuff. Should be able to standing jump down, right? Yes. And now we'll run and jump across. What's to the left? I don't see anything. Oh, come on, grab it. Here we go. So, let's find out what's up here. It's a secret. Okay, well that was good luck. I've only missed one so far. I shouldn't say that because at that, that same level I was like, oh, I'm finding all the secrets and then I didn't find the one. So let me not say anything. I'm just lucky that I found them so far and I'll leave it at that. Okay, this is going to require some timing. Eh, not too bad. Ah, oh, it would have been cool if that was also a secret. Okay, let's see what's downstairs. Uh -oh. yep. Okay, so basically climbing up was a secret. Let's find out what's down underwater then. Oh, we finished upstairs, so let's just save. Oh, there's something down here, probably a rat. Can I climb out somewhere to shoot this thing? 
Nope. Okay, so let's go through here, see where this takes us. Big open room. More rats. Okay, I can climb out here and deal with the rats. Still no keyboard shortcuts for the pistols, but I guess that's coming in a later game. This is so cool though, like... Greece has had some really interesting levels. Um, they had... Um, the Colosseum, somehow, when we're not even in Rome. Um, they had... So this is our second rusty key, I take it. So we can actually get now behind that second door. Oh, okay. Um, what's down here? Is there anything, any point in jumping to the left? Or are these all just pipes? What's down here? Okay, don't drop down there, that's dangerous. Um, yeah, so we had the Colosseum, we had all the stuff with the Greek and Norse gods, and now we've got this massive underground water network. Oh man, those rats are like really hungry, hey? I, or what kind of rats want to... They've got red eyes as well. Jeez, that is scary. But what kind of rats want to eat like a person? That's just creepy. Okay, was there anything down here? Or was it just like an extra place? Ah, seems like an extra place. Uh, dead end. Doesn't seem like there's anything down there. Uh-oh. Oh, hello. That's where that ramp leads. Okay. So, two things. So maybe, because the water level is now raised, we can maybe explore what's underwater. Um, oh, we can also get up here. Let's go up here, see what's up here. I think it's all locked, right? Yeah, the rusty key is not going to work on that. That looks like a silver key of some kind. Yeah. Thank you, Lara. You're always so kind. Um, hang on, that looks like a movable block. You can kind of see it because, like, if you, you you can see it, it almost looks like it's broken up into like four smaller blocks. Like you can see the seam in the texture. Um, okay, secret. Okay, I think I got to get up here. Let's figure out how to do this. Not bad. So you can sort of see a seam in the textures. That's how you spot the movable blocks. Um, usually games are supposed to show you what's movable and what's not because, you know, it's not fair if you can't see these things. Uh, sometimes they hide it very well because it's a secret. Um, but most of the time it's expected. They call it, uh, is it telegramming or telegraphing? I can't remember. But there's a word for it, for making it obvious what you can interact with and what you can't. Um, okay, so that's two secrets, I think, unless I'm miscounting. Oh, I didn't even check what we got. Ah, oh, well, it doesn't matter at this point. Um, all right, let's go swimming. See what's down underneath. And maybe we can climb up now where we couldn't climb before. Okay, so let's just check under here first. Because the first time we couldn't... Are we still... Hello, it's all flooded now. But we can't climb out anywhere. What is even out here? Am I backtracking? You know what? We will come back this way, I think. I'm fairly sure that you come into the swim from another angle because of the fact that there's a door there. So let us save this for another time. For now, let's see what we can find here. And I see a lever. So let's use that. Ah, is that our silver key? Annoying rat. Ooh. Ooh. 
So the silver key is down there, but uh, why do we... What are you looking at? But then why do we still have the um, rusty key? There must be a reason to still go behind those two locked doors. Uh, maybe we will find out when we come out the other side. Okay, so let's get that silver key. We're getting so many pickups now. Like, we are just, like, loaded. Oh, hello. Oh, I didn't even see this door on the ground level when we first came here. And there's another door over there. Man, I was not observant. There's a gold key. Okay, so maybe we need a gold key. You know what? Let's see. Maybe we can swim down through these spikes now. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. So that's how you get past those spikes. Clearly. Okay. Lots of underground passages here. But anything useful? Ah, uh, yes! A gold key. That's one gold key, one silver key, and one rusty key. The trinity of keys. Don't mention Trinity because Lara from the future would not like that. Okay, let's go see what's behind this last door. Uh, where do these crocodiles keep coming from? That's really not fair. Shoot the guy, Lara, you can see him. Uh, I guess we'll just come deal with him later. Rusty, I think. Yeah. Hello? Who do we have shot? Oh, we've got quite a lot of shotgun bullets. We are definitely loaded now. Game absolutely wants us to use this ammo. You know, maybe to make an interesting um, challenge run, see if we can play the whole game without using any special ammo. That'd be pretty cool. Okay, so it looks like we gotta explore upstairs. Alright. Up, oh, up, oh. Pierre, where are you? Dude is literally stalking me. This guy can take so many bullets, oh my gosh. Okay, that's gotta be enough, right? Yes. Oh, that guy's got so much health. <sighs> Alright, so let's carry on where we were before Pierre rudely interrupted us. We were climbing along all these ledges. Trying to see where they lead. And we missed this health pickup, but we got it now. I don't know. I find the cistern very confusing. It's weird because I was not confused at all by um, Palace Midas, but this is very confusing for me. Okay, so we got... Hmm. Okay, now... I think I know... I think I remember there's a really clever way to get across there. So this either will work or it won't. Ah, that worked so well. So there you go. Take one step back from the edge. And then swan dive. Will work wonders. And now we gotta climb the crevice to get across to the right. This place is so confusing. There's so many areas. And they all kind of like lead into each other. Like this is a labyrinth on steroids. Hello? This is not looking good. And I hear something below. 
Okay, we are stuck here then, because we just slid down there. I feel like we're descending down to the lower levels. And I hear a crocodile, so I'm totally getting my magnums out. Where are you? Oh boy, these things move so fast on land. And there's another one back there. Is that all? Let's explore back here. Japers, where do you guys come from? And how are you even like making a living down here? Oh, don't want to waste Agnums on that. Seems a bit unnecessary. <laughs> no rat is worth your Magnum clips. How is my health doing? Okay, we're still good. Do you remember the good old days when we could get through a level without a single health pack? Yeah, those were the days. It's a pity they're gone now. Okay, I'm confused. How are we supposed supposed to get anywhere I mean like is there somewhere I can go if I climb up here I feel like it's a dead end hope I'm not trapped nah you can't get trapped in the Tomb Raider games they've been very careful okay yeah there we go <laughs> I was very confused there's a locked door there okay that's where we came down hmm Oh, and there's a switch next to the door. Okay, so it's not like we are trapped. We can get out. Why did we even come this way again? Have we found anything else? We haven't found a gold key or anything yet. Okay, so we got to drop down there. And traverse over to the door. Man, these levels are getting really complicated. But that's such good design as well that it starts off so simple and easy and like as it goes on it starts to challenge you more and more and you have to think more carefully like that's really good game design mm -hmm. and oh boy that would have not been good can i even jump across oh this is so risky i could like impale myself on these spikes Okay, managed it. Okay, yeah, so we were kind of going in a circle. But we would have been stuck because the door was locked. So we went through all of that for nothing? Uh, unless I just totally forgot what we picked up. Maybe we picked up something and I forgot about it. That's very possible. Oh, there's the crocodile again. Almost got me. Okay, let's um, make this a little bit more fair and come out here. Take him from above. Yeah, it didn't take much. Okay, so we have explored. But then I'm so confused. How do we get to that? Hmm. There is something I am missing. Okay, well, let's lower the water level. There has to be something I'm missing. So how do we get to that? Oh, wait, this is not where we're supposed to go. Because how do we get to that locked door? Unless it's behind that silver lock there. Nah, it can't be. Maybe if we go back along that path, but with the water level um, lowered, maybe it'll make a difference. Okay, we gotta be very careful here. Especially with the game lagging like this. Okay, we're gonna traverse all the way back across.
Yeah, I think we have reached the point where I am officially semi-blind and I have no clue what's going on anymore. I mean, the point where I'm officially blind. Um, before I was semi-blind, but now I'm just like, what the heck is going on? I don't even know. Maybe there was something I missed when I was exploring here. Um, well, we're about to find out. It should be quite easy to get back across. Oh, yes, because going through that door. Yes, 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 yes. So uh, we managed to get through that silver door. Um, the place with the spike and the rat. Um where we could swim earlier, but we couldn't actually climb out there because it was flooded. So yes. Okay, I have figured it out. It just took me a while. Because <laughs> this level is so confusing. Oh my gosh. These levels do get really long though, and we're starting to see that. Um, but that's typical, and that's one of the fun things about Tomb Raider, is like, you get really immersed, and... You have to really think in order to actually navigate your way out of a level. Um, the best part about it, honestly, is Tomb Raider is not just a game. It's also like a bit of a mental exercise because you've really got to think. Okay, we are heading back for that door. We will do this. of those lions though like I, they're so fierce they just, they're, and they're just like running around making noise i mean how are there lions down here <laughs> it's just like it's crazy there's animals everywhere okay let's be very careful not to get impaled save the game okay so finally we should be able to do it now and suddenly there's a rat Seems a bit unfair. These rats just popping out on... Well, that is how rats work, I guess. Okay, so I was right. We have now found... Hello. Y'all come out of nowhere. Glad this isn't my home, because I would have to... Whoever's house this is, we got to speak to them urgently. They got a rat problem. Okay, we don't want to fall into this water, because we can't get out. Okay, we can finally climb up. That's good news. Okay, so we're going to go all the way around from the looks of things. All of this for probably... Another golden key or something. So what is this open? Silver key. Okay, so two rusty keys, two silver keys, one gold key. We kind of need all of these, I imagine, because probably once you open up that silver door, it's probably just going to be a bit confusing. What is through here? Why can we jump here? Is that just for show? That's not very nice. Oh man, you want me to drop all the way down here? That's nuts. I'm not doing that. Okay, we are going to be more careful about this. Where's the best place to drop down? Probably here. Even then we still lost a bit of health. I mean, we get. I guess we could have gone back. But we made this decision and we shall live with it. Silver key. Good. All right. Ah, Pierre. You are really annoying me now. Like, seriously, you just pop up everywhere, dude. I need to take some. 
many bullets before dying. Please run away. Save me the effort. You know what? I'm going to do it for you. There we go. And he's gone. Okay, so uh, how much health did he take? Man, this guy's really annoying. I hope we can kill him at some point. Oh my gosh, I shouldn't say such things. That's horrible. Um, oh no, we've been that way. Um, okay, so we need to raise the water. Wait, no, I'm really confused. No, that is the way we're supposed to go. Um, so we need to raise the water level again so that we can get up to that door. Um, yeah, and hopefully at some point, like there's a showdown with Pierce, we can get rid of him and he can stop annoying me like this because he's just popping up everywhere. Somehow he was gone for the whole of Palos Midas and then he just decided to come back all of a sudden. And now we've seen him three times in one level, which is really not fair. But I guess Natla does have a knack for hiring people who will, uh, or who will at least try to get the job done. I mean, we managed to get everything from Larson. Um, we didn't kill him, I don't think. Um, but we, we, hopefully, we will also get everything from Pierre. Um, so, you know, but that's how it is. You can't beat Lara Croft. Come on, she's a badass. Let's go through this door at last. Now, presumably, the, the end of the level is behind this door because we've been collecting all these keys and they have to lead somewhere, right? Silver key number one. And silver key number two. So even if we tried to come here earlier with silver key number one, we wouldn't have been able to get any further. So it's a good thing we explored down those other tunnels. Because uh, it ended up working out for us. I feel like I'm about to be ambushed. I just... Close quarters. I don't like it. Anything? Really? That's a perfect ambush opportunity and they didn't use it. Okay, so we gotta climb up. Ah, the gold key goes up there. There's nothing in that alcove. I learned the word alcove literally from video games. I would not have learned it in real life. So many random things you learn from video games. Ah, hello. Bye bye. <laughs> Sometimes the shotgun's really fun to use. I just wish we had keyboard shortcuts because then I could select the weapon I wanted without opening the menu. Okay, that door is open now at last, which is great. And still no ambushes. Such a wasted opportunity. Uh-uh, I hear you. <gasps> Back. Oh, and there's tiles on the floor. That's not good. Could fall down one of those at any moment. Okay, but there's no traps in them. At least for now. Okay, um... There might even be a secret underneath one of these. That's, they're usually quite sneaky like that. Um, let me see if I can find all of them. And then we can check underneath them, see if there's anything. Hmm. If they didn't have, that'd be a bit of a wasted opportunity. Be a good place to hide it. So what is this? This is like a checkerboard room. This is kind of strange. Oh, we missed one. Maybe there's a secret underneath this one. No, I'm just hallucinating. Okay, um, so there's this switch. No, the switch, Lara. I no clue what that did. <gasps> Three of them? You're kidding me. Wow, good thing I had a shotgun. 
That was insane. Three lions. <sighs> the game developers are a little aggressive now, hey? Oh, okay. And there's a switch here, which does something as well. That opens a door somewhere. No, what? That locks me in the room? <laughs> what? Why would you do that? Oh, hello, there's a movable block there. Maybe that's the way out. Is that a movable block as well? Or is it just the other one? It's just the other one. There's, I think, a tunnel behind that. But if I remember correctly... Let me just triple check. There might be something upstairs. So, uh, let's pull this block out as far as we can. See if we can climb up. Now, th to be fair, that is something I remember. I don't know. It, you wouldn't be able to figure that out on your own, I think. Um, unless you really just felt like climbing everywhere that you could. Uh, okay, so we can't... And it's got to go out there anyway. Okay. Let's just push it out the last little bit. So, yeah, I did have that from a vague memory. It's interesting, the little hard-to-find things, I tend to sometimes, not all the time, but I tend to remember them better than the actual level itself. Like, I got so lost this level. Um... But I remembered that I need to climb upstairs. So, randomly good memory, I guess. <laughs> okay, that should be enough. Health pack? Was that it? We came all this way for a health pack. But there's a door. But does this even lead anywhere? No, no, no. Why am I using a shotgun for the, the rats? That's just a waste. Oh man, she took so long to put them away. Okay, but what's through this door? Oh, it's just upstairs. And there's not even anything here. Okay, well that makes sense. If you fall down into this room with the three lions, at least you can climb out. So that's good. Hello. Oh yes, that was the end of the level. Okay, well, three out of three secrets, that's still pretty good. And I mean, this wasn't my favorite level. It was kind of weird. It, it was really weird. Like the whole level was kind of like just exploring some kind of plumbing system. Um which was strange. Uh, but but I've just remembered, I think this is halfway through the game. So we are officially halfway through, which is pretty cool. So um, I've, I've enjoyed it so far. I know that it gets more exciting later on. It has been exciting so far, but it just, you know, it gets like a little crazy later on. That's But that's always the case with Tomb Raider. Um, so I'm really looking forward to what's coming. We haven't found the Skion from Greece yet. Um... But hopefully we will find it soon because this is now four levels into Greece and we haven't found anything. So hopefully it's just around the corner. So thanks for sticking with me, guys. Uh, hopefully we, we will find the ski on very soon and then we can move on to the next place. I think I know where that is, but uh, I'll leave that as a surprise. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe and um, hit that bell icon if you want to find out about future videos that are coming out i'm also working on some other series that aren't let's plays um but i'm really enjoying this and who knows maybe i'll do more let's plays in the future of other games because this has been really fun for me and uh, i've sort of i know I, I was quite awkward at the beginning but i'm sort of like slowly coming into it so i'm really really enjoying this um so i might do some more stuff in the future uh, definitely we'll finish tomb raider and hopefully move on to the other ones after that but yes thanks so much and um hopefully i'll see you next time until then goodbye